How's this for a name of a nonprofit? Reading Changes Lives. Well, they have a mission to emphasize the importance of literacy in our community. And you can volunteer at an upcoming literacy festival, as Leah Bowling reports. This is the first time Reading Changes Lives will be holding the Literacy Festival. It will be on May 18th from 11 to 2 at the Literacy Garden. It's really for the kids to know that they can come have fun, but yet learn how to read. We sincerely believe that reading can change lives. Eric Smith is the founder of Reading Changes Lives. He says literacy goes beyond just reading and writing. It's a way of how we perceive thing, things, our worldview, how we navigate life. There will be lots of fun activities at the festival. We are going to have various games, we're going to have some food, food trucks, we're just going to have a lively festive time, but learning will also be taking place there. And there will be special guests reading books to children. We want to thank the Chattanooga Fire department who has partnered with us and the Chattanooga Football Club. They will be here. Alan Green with the Chattanooga Fire Department says he's excited to get involved with the community in this way. His passion aligned with my passion for literacy and just for the community. Um, I might say this fits right well with what we do, what he's trying to do. Come down, get your face painted, take pictures, read books. And also we're going to have the Chattanooga Football Club, which is our professional soccer team here. They're going to read books. Right now, there is an open call for volunteers. If we can get some volunteers to help with the parking, we'll be parking right over here at the lot there, and then also as, as greeters, and then readers, readers also. We're going to be cooking food. We may need someone to help serve food, pass out waters, pass out Gatorades, read a few books if you can. For more information on how to sign up to volunteer, head over to our website. I'm Leah Bowling, Local 3 News.